Can you sand self-leveling concrete? If you've ever worked with self-leveling concrete and encountered some bumps or unevenness after it's dried, you might be wondering if you can sand it down to achieve a smoother finish. Let's break it down. Self-leveling concrete is a versatile and efficient way to level or smooth out floors, but sometimes it doesn't turn out perfectly. If the compound dries unevenly, it's not the end of the world. You can indeed sand it down to smooth out the surface. To start, it's important to use the right tools. A power sander is your best friend here, as it will be the quickest and most effective method for smoothing out the dried compound. Use a low grit sandpaper to make quick work of the job. This will help you remove the bumps and uneven areas efficiently. For smaller bumps, you can use an electric sander with coarse sandpaper. This method is particularly effective for minor imperfections and can save you a lot of time and effort compared to manual sanding. However, it's crucial to be careful when sanding self-leveling concrete. This material has high compression strength, but very little fracture strength, which means it can break or crack easily if you apply too much pressure or use the wrong tools. To avoid this, you might consider manual sanding with a rubbing block, especially for finer adjustments. This approach can be quicker and easier on the floor than setting up and cleaning up after using an electric tool. Another thing to keep in mind is safety. When sanding self-leveling concrete, you'll be dealing with cement dust, so make sure to wear a mask and eye protection to avoid any health risks. If you find that your self-leveling compound has settled unevenly or has other issues, you can also add another layer of compound to create a new and more level finish. Just ensure that you prime and prep the existing layer properly before applying the new one. In summary, yes, you can sand self-leveling concrete to achieve a smoother finish. Use the right tools, be cautious of the material's properties, and take necessary safety precautions to get the job done effectively.